What is up guys? Welcome back to Midstate Fishing. Today's video we're not going to be fishing or talking about this hand. In today's video we're going to be cleaning out this fish tank that overnight basically went from being clear yesterday to just absolutely turning dirty and killing all my fish. So we're going to be cleaning that tank, trying to fix it and put it back to life and we got to get right to it. All right guys, I'm gonna be filming on the GoPro as we do stuff. Here is the 10 gallon tank. Here, I closed the door because I did save some fish. One guy died right there, but we got the snails, the two fish in here. Oh, at least I thought there was two. Yeah, there's two in there. We got all the snails. We got the pleco down there. And in here, we got 50 goldfish. Uh, you guys will see later what that's for. Let's get into cleaning out the tank. All right guys, I got the hose here for the tank. We're gonna be emptying out the water into this red bucket down here. And, but we're gonna do our best to, uh, and the tank is leaking. And oh my, this has already gone wrong. This has already gone wrong, there's a hole in here. Oh, this is not good, it's not good. Water and then we'll probably just take it outside and clean all the sand, clean all the filters, replace everything. Uh, make sure everything gets absolutely cleaned out. I'm all right, guys. I basically finished cleaning out the tank here. I got all the plants and stuff and filter in that little bucket down here. I'll show you a closer look. I don't really have good lighting, but. Down there, as you can see, one fish, and over here, two fish. Those, those fish were creamsicle mollies. I had two of them. I also had two Dalmatian mollies, but yeah, I can't find those Dalmatian mollies anywhere in here. I only see those two creamsicle mollies. I also had a red wag, uh, red tail, red red whip, red red something molly. I think it was a red wag molly. Um, he died earlier though. I managed to take him out. Um, I don't know, guys. Leave a comment down below if you know what happened the tank and why it got all murky all of a sudden just overnight and why all the fish just died but i don't know hopefully i can clean everything and get back to having a good normal healthy tank all right guys final update of the night got that fish tank took it downstairs left it outside overnight just so it doesn't like smell bad and stuff um, and i'll see you guys early in the morning peace out what's up guys it is the next day we're gonna go right now downstairs outside and clean the fish tank up Alright guys, we got this stuff here, the, all the stuff inside the aquarium and then the aquarium itself. I'm just going to basically clean it down for you guys. Um, quick pro tip, never use soap while cleaning an aquarium. It's going to infect all the fish inside and um, not good for the aquarium. But I just do a rinse and make sure all the dirt is, and all that food and gunk is out. And then make sure all these are cleaned up and we'll put it back in my room after. Move the gravel and sand into there. Got some in here, but that's fine. I just wanted to make sure most of the tank was clean in there. All right, we got the little tank set up here with the rocks and gravel. Now we're just going to wash the rest of the kind of plants and stuff and put those guys back in. All right guys, we finished up. It's dark out, the sun is set. We're finally done. Take this thing inside the house. Oh. Oh, I just broke it. Did I just break it? I just broke it guys. I just broke my aquarium. On Oh. Well guys, I just spent an hour and a half redoing the whole entire fish tank. Like, I finished everything, I picked it up, I started walking it, then I tripped over the cord. 
I don't know if you guys can see that right there. It cracked. The bottom of the fish tank cracked. Huge hole in it. Just my luck. This whole whole year, whole year has just been from this. I, I'm lost for words right now. I cracked the whole bottom of the fish tank. This video has officially started from going wrong to just completely gone wrong. Just completely wasted my day on this dumb fish tank. I think I'm going to be taking a break from doing fish tanks. As of right now, I just got to say leave a like on this video and please subscribe it and make me feel better. And I guess I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. What's up guys? So after last night, um, I completely gave up on the tank and I literally just went to my room and just went to bed because I was so mad at the, that I broke that tank. Um, but I thought about it last night and I did remember I have about a five gallon tank that I'm going to put up for now. And I think I'm going to be taking a break from doing fish tanks. Pretty soon guys, we might be getting some new tanks for the house. Um, I don't know, some cool things might be happening soon, but right now, I'm gonna put a small tank up in my room. And okay guys, I don't know if you saw it from last night. I think I'm gonna be taking a break from doing fish tanks, but this is the tank I'm using now. This was the tank I was gonna use until two hours after cleaning it. See that huge hole right there? I dropped it on this little light switch right here because the cord fell and that caused the whole bottom thing to crack which was I was very sad but what we can do for now guys is just use this tank for now and I'm gonna put some sand and some decorations into this tank and we're just gonna use that for now and I just broke that too so well so much for air filter man our luck is really really been going strong today um, maybe I can take this guy out put this guy in maybe I think I'm gonna be taking a break from doing fish tanks all right guys we finally got the tank or a tank I guess since my other one broke but I think I'm gonna be taking a break from doing fish tanks at least we're gonna have a fish tank in my room but yeah guys I'm just gonna put water in here then put the other fish in here to acclimate to the new tank and I'm gonna see you after I do all that guys all right guys welcome back to an update um, we got the fish in here acclimating to the water we have the pleco in here he kind of fell in there i was going to dump him in the tank but he jumped out of the tank into the little cup luckily but yeah guys we have the tank all set up fish acclimating and i'll come back guys when the fish are ready to get into the tank all right it's been about 15 minutes about acclimating now i'm going to take these guys out I hope you guys enjoyed this video of the failed slash gone wrong slash old tank to new tank video. Um, thanks for watching this video, guys. Uh, leave a like so I get some motivation, guys. Subscribe. We're almost to 100 subscribers. Let's get there, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out. I just bought a new tank.